recall what I was doing. That's typically how it goes when jumping <laughs> in and out of a game like Fallout or Skyrim or <laughs> what the fuck was I doing last? That's just like all the time with me. Okay, wait, it's coming back to me. Here's old dude. I think he's my friend now. No, that's not that's that was his old partner. This guy. I'm talking about I'm talking about the other guy. That's Boone? Yeah. Oh, Boone's on the left. Yeah, yeah, Boone is your partner. Okay, Manny was his partner, his former partner. Yeah, but I'm saying I already did his quest. Like, he's already following me around. But why are we here? Yeah. So that he can confront him, maybe? You have I any think so. Ghouls? I'm counting on you. So wasn't he, like, the thing? No, he wasn't. Oh, it was that she, lady. And he, she, it was the lady. Yeah. yeah, yeah. She, he already blew her head yeah. off. Yeah. See ya. I remember that. The, right. There's a funny thing about that mission like if you hadn't already done her you could get him to eliminate person after person after person just by getting them to follow you <laughs> and putting the hat on and and it wouldn't count against you in karma and anything like that you could just pick off people you didn't like i got a buddy now pretty cool and the more you do with him he will unlock his actual story arc that you will complete I like playing this game in third person just so I can stare at that juicy booty. I always play in third person. Yeah, but I don't think you play as a girl. I do not. <laughs> You're missing out. That's where it's at. Okay, I should probably we'll figure out like where where I'm going. Wait. There we go. Okay. I get the point of staring at something aesthetically pleasing, but I've always played games to like try to put myself. Yeah, no, that's that. normal. <laughs> well, I know a lot of guy friends that only play with girls that's and true. like play as girls, and I'm like, why? You don't are get you, the are... option. I mean, you know, it's gotten more over the years, but I'm an old school gamer, at least for my generation, and it, that wasn't an option in a lot of games. Ever, every single time I saw the option, I was like, fuck yeah. Hell yeah, I do. All right, so wait. This. This is the main one. I feel like, I don't know. What's the one that he wanted? It's probably some BS that I don't care about, though, right? Mm, more than likely. Uh, enter the divide. So these are all DLC or what? The uh, Midnight Science Happy Trails, the Reunion, Sierra Madre, and yeah, those those bottom four are all DLCs. I want to do this one. Which one? Sweet. Okay. Whoa! Come on, man. Damn it. Fly with me. I had it on my stupid map there. Oh! Yeah. Okay, so I, I selected it so I should already have a... Come on, Boone. Let's do this. I wonder if I'm going to need better armor one day. I just like this one. I'm probably going to have to wear a bunch of ugly stuff too, huh? Enjoy the juicy booty while it's there. <laughs> or it's covered up with like steel plates and fucking license plates and whatever. <laughs> there he is. Uh, my favorite armor is the Desert Ranger. I don't know, I don't mind this one. Yeah. That's what they call, um, damn, racing on the word. Scenic, mm -hmm. fuck, I don't remember. But it's like laying the ground for the mission I'm going to do, but there's a irradiated ghoul right there. That's what I'm going to do. It's to investigate ghoul activity. 
Storytelling. Scenic storytelling. We're already like, oh shit, here's a... Irradiated body. Hmm. I get rads if I go near it. Yeah. Uh, I'm trying to remember. I think it's... Fallout 4 rads play even more. I don't even see where my rads are. Like, they're not red, so I guess I don't understand how it works anymore. <laughs> this pile of ash let me add a laser laser weapon laser beams enter the facility and discover the source of the ghouls are there like tapes and stuff in this one I can't I don't recall the holotapes yeah yes sweet I want to find one Aw, oh, damn it. Second time's the charm, buddy. Energy cell. A mine box? Oh, I should really just push X. That'd be, that'd be the smart route. A bottle cap? One bottle cap? Oh, shit. Oh no, this whole table's full. Alright. I don't want the chessboard though, like. Bottle caps money, right? Yes, bottle caps are money. God, it's gonna make me pick up every one of these individually. Yeah. Oh. I normally just wipe the entire table and then drop the bullshit I pick up. Jesus. Come on. Give me this too while you're at it. How do I jump? Can I jump? Couldn't uh, I jump? Oh, I can't because I'm fucking encumbered you're again. Encumbered again. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. The few things from that table did it, huh? Go figure. For sure. Poison gland. What are these cases? Case 9mm. So the that cases machine? are for, for making ammo. But they don't weigh anything. No. Normally the scrap that you have to make ammo doesn't weigh a damn thing. And the actual ammo you get doesn't weigh a damn thing. Now if you were to play on survival mode, all that shit weighs something. Why do I have a damaged garden now? I don't know. I would drop it. Dinky... Dinky the T-Rex souvenir. He only weighs 0. 0.1. Keep him. Empty syringe. A sensor module? I have two of them. They're four pounds each. Um, no, it's not four pounds each. If it says that weight in the corner, that's the total amount of weight for all of it you're holding. What are you talking about? I'm, in, like, in the item. I'm in the thing. Yeah, I know. You're looking at the central module. So if you drop one, that weight will drop down to two. Uh, yeah, they're two each. Oh, right. They're okay, two well, pounds okay. each. Okay, all right. Yeah. So what the is that? Module, the reason I told you to keep the sensor modules, because what it's going to do is when you finally get the ability to craft, you can make an auto stem pack with those sensor modules. It will sense with your when your health gets low and it'll automatically trigger the stem pack and start to heal you. I think all of my weight is in this fucking aid section. Man. And are your weapons. Uh, yeah. Uh a broad machete. I know I was keeping that. It's a decent melee for the time being. Should I keep all these grenades in mines? I uh, definitely would. Because Dynamite, plasma pistol. Yeah. A ripper. When you start to, the actually you might be able to What's the damage on the broad machete compared to the the ripper? Thirty one to 
35 in the broad machete. You told me to pick up Ripper because it had a name. Uh, well, it's it's the fact that it's a uh, it uh, it can do a lot of damage really fast. It's a, it's it's like an automatic dagger. Both of these shotguns. You uh, get rid of the single shotgun and keep the sturdy caravan shotgun. I have a lot of grenades. I think that's what's weighing me down. Like a lot of grenades and dynamite. Apparel. I mean, they don't really weigh very much other than what I'm wearing. Oh, hey, yeah, I got this. It weighs three. But I didn't want to cover up my blue hair. Oh, the hat? Yeah. I would keep the recon beret. I don't want that. It's the Vexillarius. Oh, helmet. you can drop that. No. Uh, don't worry about that. I just said no. I wasn't going to. Oh, I thought you were talking about the, the recon beret. No. Yeah, a lot of my weight seems to be in well aid out of now none of my ammo costs anything i probably don't need all of this like i could get rid of this nine millimeter submachine gun because i have or the pistol because i have the pistol i would get rid of the i have a weathered 10 millimeter pistol does it use the 9mm ammo or 10mm ammo? It says weathered 10mm. It uses 10mm. Okay, then I would get rid of your... You can get rid of the 9mm submachine gun. Because you're trying to conserve ammo and using an automatic weapon for you is not going to... Work? Conserve ammo. Oh. <clears throat> what about this plasma pistol? I would... How much plasma ammo do you have? 73. Why does the... Oh, because it's DPS and damage. Okay, never mind. I have a... Uh, plasma... I thought I had a plasma uh, laser rifle. That's what I have. MF cell. E cell. I don't want to keep them. I don't know. I'm under now, but it's going to hit me again. For sure. Probably. Oh, can I? How do I put something on what's his face? Can I? Or is he? Yes. Just... You. Uh, you go over to him. You open up his character wheel, and he should have his inventory on there. And you can trade shit to him and get him to wear it and stuff like that. Fine by me. I can make him my personal fucking pack mule. You actually can. If there's a lot of shit that You're you damn right I can want to keep. That you can't fucking carry, they can carry it for you. Yeah. I did the same shit in Fallout 4. And uh, a lot of Skyrim as well. Because there's a lot of fucking shit to carry. I'm going to give him... I don't know. I think I'm going to give him some of this alcohol. You carry this. Yeah, All I'm, the liquor. Yeah. Here's my walking mini fridge. I will tell you, if you give them stim packs, they will use them. Oh. Well, that's good to and know. if you give them ammo, they will use it. Well, I ain't giving them none of that. Typically, anything you put on them... some junk food. That, yeah, that's, that's not gonna... He, he might use some of it to try and heal, but... Scotch. It's not gonna be as effective as... You can have all like, that. Impacts and shit. Sunset sarsaparilla. And, oh, here's vodka. And whiskey. Will he drink my sarsaparilla? I'm not sure. Probably not. Those are special caps. Dirty water. Why do I even have that? Jalapeno pepper. Shit. Uh, I think that's it. Absent. Miscellaneous. He can carry... No, none of those cost anything. He can carry my dinky, the T-Rex. If he dies, he's like dead dead, huh? They take all my stuff, too? What do you mean? I don't count. No. What if I give him the laser rifle? Will he use it? 
Probably not. Why? Then have the ammo. He How does ammo he... work with them? Um. Sometimes it's glitchy because there was one point in time. I don't know if they fixed it, but there was one point in time where you could just give them one ammo and they would have infinite ammunition. Yeah, I mean, regardless, that's kind of the thing. You're not playing as them, so you can't collect ammo for them. Yeah. Look at me, put it on, yeehaw, mother truckers. <laughs> Fine by me. Sometimes they'll automatically put on the better gear themselves, too. How do I put it on them? Oh, I Fine can't. Fine by me. I can't tell no. him to use a weapon or anything. No, that's what I'm saying. He's going to favor his rifle for everything. Then how that's, do I dress him in what I want him to wear? Uh, you give him gear, and then you take away the gear that he's wearing. Huh. Okay. If you want him to wear a specific outfit, you give him something and then take away what he's wearing. Apparel. Can I make him run around naked? Uh, I don't think so. Maybe. I'm not <laughs> sure. I've never actually, like, <laughs> devoted my uh, time to making my companions <laughs> to run around naked. It's pretty funny. <laughs> For sure. He's wearing glasses, a cowboy hat, and running around in his underwear. Yeehaw. I don't have pants for you, buddy. Fine by me. <laughs> At least I don't think I do. Does he need pants, though? Like, is the all is he easier to die? I guess. Without I mean, pants? he won't die. They they never die. He will just get like. I thought they died wounded. for good. What do you mean? You don't know. Let me see. I'm looking. I, I don't ever recall them being able to die. In some of them, the dog dies. It's just gone. The dog. The dog in Fallout 3 can die. He's essential. He cannot die. Hmm, essential. As long as so he's... he can carry all my shit. Yep. But yeah, he can't die. Most of the companions you pick up are essential characters and they cannot die. Yeah, now he looks cool. Into it. Good job, Boone. Let's go. Off. To secure our fortune. The sweet ass hat you got there. Desperado. <laughs> now he's wearing the uh, he's wearing the wolf one now. Oh, he's wearing the wolf damn. Sorry, I was on the Google search looking at the boon. Oh snap, Zilla. Oh shit. <laughs> what just happened? Did you see? There was a delay on that. Oh, maybe it was Boone that just wrecked him. Yeah, it's, it's Boone. It's just wrecking yeah. them. Boon. Boon Rex. I'm telling you. Boon is probably one of the best companions when it comes to guns. I feel like I should be in Fallout New Vegas. Using a different weapon. No. I mean, and if you also notice, he highlights you in red. Yeah. From a distance. Like, he automatically picks them out, he spots them, and they're highlighted in red like their silhouette and everything is red 
He slices, he dices, he makes julienne fries. Jesus Christ. Well, I'm in good hands. Indeed. Boone is typically one of the very first com companions I go for and keep him for a while. I don't know if you can get him to use a better rifle. I don't remember if I've tried or not, like giving him a 50 cal or something, you know? Because him with a 50 cal would just be devastation. I do remember I used to suit him up in the the black ranger armor, which is the, the trench coat and all that, with the body armor from the, the opening sequence. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's my favorite armor in the game. Dog meat and a pack of cigarettes, huh? <laughs> Repcon facility. Who are you? It doesn't matter, smooth skin. Who are you? Time and get up here. <laughs> I gotta turn my AC on. Give me just a second. I don't know why I didn't already do that. I knew I was hot previously. I just thought it was magically going to go away or something or what? Right. Where are you located? Like I said, find the metal staircase in the big room on the east side of the building. It's where they used to make rockets. Sure. Stop wasting time. What the heck? Oh. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Where the fuck is Boone? He's abandoned you. I know. I was like, oh, I'm in good hands. Not in any hands, apparently. Look at this big old beefy mofo. He looks so angry. Nightkin. Yep. It's a variant of super mutants. So what? I don't get Boone in here? He should come in. Jesus. So slow, Boone. What the hell, man? He's scoping the building out. I'm kidding. I don't know. He should have already been in there. Yeah, he's rude. You're rude. Ah. She's, She's rude. rude. What? She's rude. Why is it putting vats on Boone? Uh, it targets anybody. Oh, Lord. Because of course it does. Figured out how to use vats. Point blank. <laughs> yeah, so you get the weapon the skills up. It works every time. There's a paint gun. Some other shit. It's empty. It says it's empty. Fuck. Dead cool. You know what's sad? Alright, I'm on Destiny, okay? I just went running up to a dresser like I was playing Fallout, like I was gonna search through the goddamn dresser 
for whatever content we're in it, and I'm looking at it, I'm like, oh, wait, I'm on Destiny. I'm not the one playing Fallout. I can't do that shit. <laughs> oh, you're supposed to be shooting things. Yeah, that, that's all you do. You see the Gudra man? It's probably gone. Oh, it's not gone. I caught it. Of course I did. I used an Ultra Ball. <laughs> I wanted it. I think it's a dragon type. Gudra. Gudra. Because it's good. Because it's good. Oh no, don't fucking stop. Ah, Jesus Christ. Just wanted to look at stuff, and then all of a sudden I'm drinking out of this dirty water. Cigarettes and cups and fucking bunch of bullshit. Ending machine. I got a new Coca Cola. I remember collecting those in '76. Yeah. That was kind of fun. They were fun to look at, I guess. Hey, what the fudge? Shut the front door. I don't know who just. Oh, Jesus Christ. No, not Boone. For fuck's sake! <laughs> Do you have head trauma? Cause like... I don't know if it's the, the stream getting blurry on me, or if it's your actual, like... Head. Uh... What head? Like, if you suffer head trauma in the game, your vision starts to blur, like, in and out. Oh shit. I think the internet's doing something fucky. Fun. Mm-hmm. Alright, it seems... Seems better now, okay. Sheesh. Maybe it's just my computer. I don't know, I'll check. I might have a head injury, I don't know. <laughs> okay, what do I... I have 15 points. I need... Lockpick. For sure. <clears throat> you won't be able to pick the next lock difficulty until you hit 50, though. I'm going to tell you that right now. It's 25, 50, 75, and 100. And 100 is for master. I can't have requires level eight. Fight the power. Looking for a certain one, but fuck, there's a lot of them. Fourth skill to be a tag skill? I don't know what that means. You can tag a fourth skill to automatically get increased by 15 points. If I pick that one? Yes, if you pick that and perk. And it's only one skill? Yes. You pick, you pick that, you pick one skill, it automatically gets boosted by 15 points.
Yeah, I don't know where that that one perk I was looking for is. I don't even remember what it was called. The oh, you mean the trait? Yeah, I guess. The traits are a one-time thing in the very beginning of the game. Oh well, to that's my lame. to my knowledge, yeah. That's what I was saying, because um, the Wild Wasteland, you only get the choice to do it right there in the beginning of the game. I don't know if I picked it or not. I think you did. You can double check your character stats and everything to find out what you picked. Hmm. <laughs> With the bloody mess part, characters and creatures you kill will often explode into a red gut-ridden eyeball-strewn paste. Fun! Oh, and you'll do 5% extra damage with all weapons. Oh, that would be cool if I could see. Why can't, why can't I see it? <laughs> so dark. No, I don't have head damage. Yeah, there it is. Wild Wasteland. I should have picked that other one. Yeah, but see, it's in the same area. The trait, the wild wasteland, is a perk. It's a perk? I thought it was a trait. It's listed under perks. Huh. Alright. Yeah, the internet did something fucky there for a minute. Yeah, now it's saying I'm disconnected from Xbox Live. Well, okay then. I think where they wanted me to go is that other door, but I don't play by the rules. <laughs> yeah, I really wish I had like a better light. I guess maybe if I do this, then it's not so bad. Wow, what the fuck? <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> what was the name of the perker trait you were talking about earlier? I don't know. I don't remember. All I know is it had something to do with everybody missing all their shots all the time. Empty, 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 everything's empty. Empty. Pretty sure I came through a hole in the wall, not a door. Maybe I did come in through a door. Fuck, I don't know. Shit. Go this way. Why do the doors have to open into my face? I don't know. Just to be annoying? I guess. It's working! That shit. Ah, it says it's empty. Not safe.
Damn it. Peacock. <laughs> At least it's not thief lock picking. It's just fucking. Ben's just out there shooting everybody. I'm in here breaking Picking into a lot. saves. It's <laughs> cool. That's cool, Boone. Just kill everybody. Yeah, don't worry about it. <clears throat> don't you worry about a thing. You got it, Boone. God damn these fucking doors. They smack me in the face and push me backwards every time. I'm like looking for fucking <laughs> magazines and shit. Alright, that was just a circle, so Yeah, if you if you notice there's actually a difference between you'll find books and you'll find magazines. There's actual skill books that give you a permanent three point increase to whatever specific skill it talks about. Hmm. Whereas the magazines are uh, temporary boosts. This ghoul's got a bunch of shit on him. Every one of them. Not the, you know, the, the non angry oh. ones. No, <laughs> not Boone! Jesus Christ. I gotta hurry up and kill shit. Fucking Boone won't let me have any kills. <laughs> I might have mentioned that. <laughs> that I wouldn't get hardly any? You don't get the experience from it, do you, if he kills him? You're asking me? I don't remember. It's been a minute. I guess I'll check next time he domes somebody. I'm, I'm looking. I'm sure it won't be long. My drink went down the wrong pipe. Okay. I think I'm I think I'm okay. <laughs> Maybe not. No wishful thinking. Ugh, Jesus. Should I take scrap metal or what? No. Okay. I feel like I've been here before. You yeah. do get experience when they kill. Isn't this the way I'm supposed to go? I mean, according to the marker, yes. Come on, you can do it! Oh, I can't. I can't pass the rubble. Okay, then. It's not. You can't do it. Just kidding. Rep contest site. I think is where he... Well, my marker's not saying that, but... Oh, that just takes me back outside. Alright. Well, that's good to know. One bottle cap. Oh boy. I don't know what I'm gonna spend it on, but figure it out eventually. Oh jeez god, Rick. <laughs> oh my god, my bats failed me. Oh Jesus. There we go. Nope, I think that was a boon. Fucking moon! 
trade in with a different companion just so I can fucking kill something. <laughs> he saves you ammunition, though. He saves me enjoyment. <laughs> I guess that's fair. Oh, yes. Open this broken door. Seems like I'm going the right way. Maybe. Yeah, this is probably the right way. <clears throat> Vats don't fail me now. Oh my god, I hit him every time. Get off me, punk! Yeah. Boone. It's, it's, it's always Boone. I'm like, oh shit, I got him. And then I see Boone in the background and I'm like, no, I didn't get shit. I got nothing. <laughs> it was Boone every fucking time. You see the shot pop off from behind you. God damn it, Boone. Yeah. Basically. Let me kill something for fucking once. There's another Nightkin. He's not damaged at all, though, so it's like, how did he die? What gym does he use? <laughs> does he train with the rock? For sure. What are you? Training. Ash pile. There's a lot of rebar clubs, and you know the Nikens have those on them too, so I guess when I find a ash pile that has that in it, it's probably a dead Nikon. More than likely. <clears throat> Dark in here. Oh shit. If you want to use a scope, I can spot for you. Give you a target. If I want to use a scope, you can spot for me? What are you what are you saying, dude? What does that mean? I think you can adjust how aggressive he is, too. I saw that you in can. the wheel. But I don't think I'm going to, because then what, do I, what would I have to bitch about? That is true. Yeah. Just... Just gotta have it. <laughs> it's just light. Ah, fuck! Ah, fuck! Ah, oh, shit! Not Boone! I don't have enough ammo. Fuck my life. Ah, oh, ow. He fucking went invisible. Boone killed him. <laughs> You're so OP, Boone. All hail Boone. For sure. I need to not use that gun if I don't have any fucking ammo for it. Jesus. Yeah, free bar club. Again. So there's nightkins here and feral ghouls. And non feral ghouls. Yep. Yes. The bright followers, whatever they are. Watch it! Watch it! Ah! Shoot him, Boone! God, I did it. Haha, -ha, I think. You were reloading, bitch. I beat you to it, Boone. Fuck you. I keep searching these stupid Nikens thinking they'll have something on them. And they never do. They always just have that rebar club, whatever the fuck. Yeah, the Nightkin don't Can have I much in the on? ways of good weaponry. No. Alright. Be like cooler if I could. Lots of Scorch books. 
Wonder how I'll know when I see one that isn't. It'll tell you differently. It'll like have a specific name on it. That and it'll actually look decent. It won't look like it's a, a burnt book. Hmm. Watch it. Shit, fire. No. Oh, God. Did he kill both of them? Dang, Boone. Don't fuck with this guy. Nope, I'm not gonna search him. I'm not gonna fucking search him. Not doing it. Oh, you know, I should. I should probably heal myself for something. Should suffice. Nope, it says it's empty. Yeah. Boom fucks them up. <clears throat> There's so much junk everywhere. Junk that I can pick uh up. That is actually one thing that I really did enjoy that they did with Fallout 4 is that absolutely every single piece of scrap, junk, whatever you find lying around can be used for something. Yeah, that's like 76 too. Yeah, but they didn't have that for 3 in New Vegas. Like, there's a lot of junk in the game that's just fucking junk. Wow, that still didn't max out my health? That's crazy. Guess we'll just keep going down. Till we find a nightkin that'll talk to us, I guess. That are just attacking instantly. I mean, that would be ideal. Fire! Jerk. And Boone killed him while he was still invisible. And I was reloading. <laughs> he has shit. He has a jail key. I don't want that flamethrower. Not really. Those fucking flamethrowers are heavy as shit. Yeah, that's what I figured. So I declined. Brax. I cleaner. usually do too. Sure does look a lot like. Uh. That's another jail key. What are you fucking? Oh, I guess like. If you didn't loot it off the other guy, you'd find it here, maybe? Yeah. Sometimes they have multiple keys lying around the same place. Yeah, multiple avenues of acquiring it. Yeah. Well, I think I've went all the way to the bottom. Gotta go up now. If I was even supposed to come down here in the first place, which is debatable. Probably not. 
But I think I've killed everything here. Which usually means it's time to go. I can find my way back out of here. Be cool. Is he even Boone's fucking lost? Oh, there he is. <laughs> I can say. I don't know where he is. Boone doesn't know where he is. There we go. Here's the exit. I found it. I found the exit. <clears throat> where this thing is trying to now oh, this way and then up the stairs probably I should be taking these laser rifles at least until mine's done Probably, yes. Oh, I have a plasma rifle. That's not the same. No. 12 damage. No. Versus 27 damage, so I don't think I want the laser rifle. All right, smooth skin. I'm letting you in. You better watch yourself. I'll sure as hell be watching you. God, but I What you the fuck? Ugly. Boone! Get upstairs and talk to God Jason before I throw up just from looking at you. Hey, you're not a ghoul, even though I can't see your face. Thanks, Boone. Your pranks <laughs> won't work on me, smooth skin. They won't work on Jason either. Smooth skin? Your skin looks pretty smooth to me. Stop wasting my time, smooth skin. Go waste Jason's. Didn't even get to see him. I can't take anything. Repcon test site requires key. Oh shit! Oof. A lot of them up here. Hello, person. Jason will lead us to the far beyond. Y'all look all jacked up. The holy fire will carry us. Go bother Jason, smooth skin. I don't <laughs> like having you around. <laughs> Rude. Good idea. How? All praise the great journey. All praise the creator's divine will. Creepy. Hello, Wanderer. Please forgive us our humble surroundings. Our true home awaits us in the far beyond. Have you come to help us complete the great journey? What's the great journey? We wish to escape the barbarity of the wasteland, especially the violence and bigotry of its human inhabitants. I remember that mission. The Creator has promised to my flock a new land. A place of safety and healing. A paradise in the far beyond. Preparations for the great journey were nearly complete when the demons appeared. Tell me more about these demons. The demons appeared from nowhere. Except it might be more accurate to say they never actually appeared at all. 
The demons are invisible. Where one of them stands, the most one sees is the air shimmering, like sunlight on water. They set upon us as we were on our way to worship one morning. We had just entered the basement. My flock fought bravely and killed a few, but at such cost. Nearly half of us died or went missing. The rest of us retreated up here. One of the demons raved at us, but they have not tried to attack us since. Still, their demonic presence brought all progress towards the great journey to a standstill. But now you have come. Once again, the Creator has sent a human to help us across a seemingly insurmountable obstacle. You say one of the demons raved at you? Yes, over the intercom. Threats of death should we step outside. Guarantees of safety should we stay locked away. It went on for hours and did not always make sense. But that was the first day only. Since then, silence. Will you drive away the demons, Wanderer? I'll take care of the demons for you. I feel like I already did, man. Praise the Creator. Bless you, Wanderer. Bless us all. As soon as the underground has been rid of demons, preparations for the great journey can resume. Is the way clear? What? Yeah, I did. Uh... What is this far beyond? I have glimpsed it only in visions, Wanderer, but what I have seen is truly miraculous. It is a place of light and healing, and I know in my soul that my flock will be safe there. Uh, who are you? I am Jason Bright, the prophet of the Great Journey. All the ghouls you see here are members of my flock. Uh. How will you make the journey? The means by which the Great Journey is to be accomplished are an article of faith, not to be discussed with outsiders. What's the deal with the human who let me in? You're referring to Chris. I doubt you had much luck if you tried telling him that he's human. We had the same discussions when he first appeared, and the same lack of success. He believes he is one of us. Soon enough we realized that Chris was a gift from the Creator. He is integral to the success of the Great Journey. I'm here because feral ghouls have been wandering into Novak. And they've been shooting them down like animals, haven't they? Those ghouls were members of my flock, even after the madness consumed their minds. We never let them wander free. We kept them safe on the first floor. We kept them contained. The demons must have let them out, somehow. And now they are lost forever, denied the salvation and healing glow of the far beyond. Please, Wanderer, bear in mind that every feral ghoul you spare now is one that we can save later. Once the way is clear, our feral brothers and sisters will accompany us on the great journey. If there are any left. <laughs> I killed a bunch already, so... Yeah. I understand. <laughs> I know you will fulfill your promise. Not really much of a choice in it. No, not really. Alright. Well, I can't take anything, so... Hey. <laughs> hey. Right away. Rad X. Why do they need that? Probably not for them. It's probably left over from the facility.
Sorry, we don't talk to outsiders. Talk to Jason if you have business here. Talk to Jason. My vocal cords are fucked. <laughs> I'm gonna wake you up just so you can tell me you don't want to talk to me. The holy fire oh, he'll, will he carry does talk us to me. our salvation. No, he doesn't. All right then, whatever. <clears throat> All right. I guess I don't get it. They said to get rid of all the Nikon, which I did. How many did you get rid of? I don't know. I didn't count them. I don't think I got rid of any of them. Boone killed them all. <laughs> that that is a fair statement. I just stood around and watched. How many is there supposed to be? Jesus Christ, something's wrong with the internet. I don't know if it looks good on the stream or not, because it's not even good enough to keep my browser running. I keep having to fucking reload it. Or yeah, maybe that was just a me problem. Maybe four or five. What did I even get the jail key for? with any of these come fly with me okay that's the quest
you're not one of those things out there. Harland. Who the hell are you? Jason sent me out down sent me down here to get rid of the demon. And I bet he told you it's the creator's will for you to risk your ass instead of him, right? Well, good luck with that. I'd give you a hand, but no thanks. I may look like a corpse, but I'm partial to living. How'd you end up trapped down here? First off, I'm not trapped. This was a tactical choice, all right? I'm no match for those things out there. So I found a good defensive position, and I've been defending it, right? Oh, who am I fooling? I'm trapped. Name's Harland. Pleased to meet you. What happened was, I was escorting folks down to work when those things attacked us. Most of the fight was upstairs, but some folks panicked and made for the basement, and I went after them. Well, turns out there were even more of those bastards down here than upstairs, and things went to shit fast. I couldn't find the others, so I fell back to this room, set up a nice little kill zone. End of story. You don't look like the other ghouls from Bright's group. Guess the outfit gives that away, huh? I never did buy into that religious mumbo-jumbo with the robes and all that shit. It gets lonely out in the wastes, okay? And I don't have to tell you that Bright's group has got some fine-looking ghoulettes in it. Huh? Or maybe I would have to tell you. Fine-looking ghoulettes. Anyway, I helped them out, and they kept me supplied with ammo and pleasant company. How can I help get you out of this room? Huh. Well, you're polite. I'll <clears> give you that. If this was just between you and me, I'd do as you ask. But it's not. I had a friend with me when those mutant bastards came out of nowhere. She panicked and ran the wrong direction. Further into the basement. She's probably dead. But I ain't leaving until I know for sure. I'd have gone looking myself. Except I wouldn't last a minute out there. You, on the other hand, seem pretty resourceful. Find my friend, and I'll get out of your way. How have you survived? I'm not delicate. Rad roach meat for protein. Condensation off the pipes for water. Then I do my business over in the far corner. I wouldn't say it's been comfy. Alright, I'll try and find your friend. Thanks. Or I could just Let fucking kill you. Out. Here's hoping she's okay. Uh, I hopped for the kill. Did you? I'm kidding. No, I didn't. Sounds boring. What? To kill? Mm-hmm. That's fair. Ow, Jesus. Did just that just shoot everything. me? Ah, fuck! That's fucking rude. Alright, well... wants me to go find his friend. And I guess I have to eat something now. And so I took a shotgun to the chest like twice. Isn't that amazing? Ah, shit! I you took buff out. Eat didn't something mean... after taking a shotgun to the chest to heal? Yes. My leg's broken. It happens. He's okay. Damn. I had fucking one or two doctors bad. Now I only have one. Who the fuck is this guy? Antler says you are the one killing my Ken. Antler says you must die. What? So he would have talked to me, but he's not going to now.
screw you, Antler, Davison, whatever. So what? I would have done something different to somehow avoid killing the Nightkin? I don't know how. I've always had the issue with that mission. Jesus. Empty filing cabinets. Galore. Oh shit! Oh, wow. I thought the floor fell out from beneath me. <laughs> I mean, it kind of did, but... I like, I thought I was falling, falling. Hmm. Wait. No. Now I'm just like in the sewers. Underneath uh, the Repcon facility. I think so. Do I want fission batteries or? Not that I'm aware of, no. Okay. And they're way too heavy. They look so tiny. They're heavy. Yeah, fission battery, one a piece weighs six pounds. Wow. Huh? They look like a fucking D. Right? Nope. That bitch, six pounds. That's a. I don't even know what size of a battery that is. Almost a car battery? No, I think those are heavier. Maybe. I don't know. Don't catch me lying. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. Okay. I will BRB. That actually sounds like a good idea. Suit. Oh boy! I could put it on Boone. Could be a spaceman. Fine by me. Give you some more stuff. Fine by me. Gonna take off in rockets, huh? Hello? Who's down there? What's the deal with all the rockets down here? That's none of your business, Smooth Skin. Jason was very clear. Get rid of the demons, then report back. He didn't tell you to poke around down there. Got it? Got it. Let's hope you do. 
There's a cigar burning. Two. Who's been smoking in here? All right. Short intermission, real quick. I'm gonna use the bathroom as well. Be right back. I think I'll try and go till midnight. I lost some time and started late. Plus, you get to sleep in tomorrow, so you'll be fine. As long as I go to bed before one, it'll be okay. I guess Fen's MIA. Shit. Oh my god, my buff out. That I accidentally took. Just eating shit. Lots of shit. in there. <clears throat> nope. To the Mojave Wasteland. Okie dokie. I am back. Welcome back. I thought you were already back. No, I wasn't. Just trying to load up my Xbox. Mm. Play me some Fallout if I can. I put Boone in a spacesuit. <laughs> no, he's my spacesuit, buddy. Basic boon. I was laughing in my head last night because I did the whole uh, rubber ducky song while you were doing uh, Death Stranding. Oh, yeah. And you didn't know, like, how the lyrics go? <laughs> no. Rubber ducky, you're the one. You make bath time lots of fun, rubber ducky. My bad. It's a horrible song, I know. Mm -hmm. It really lightens the mood of Fallout. True. Alright, I gotta find a dude's friend, I guess. I think there was something about a jailer in the basement. I don't know. I just went to the. I'm in the. Well, I'm in the basement right now, so. I think the jailer is one of the nightkin, if I'm correct. Killed everyone I've come across. Yeah, yeah. Well, they're invisible, too, so you might not. I mean, I can see them, kind of. That's true. 
looks like a new room. Empty. Yeah, that's a new path. I think. Yep, jail key. Finally. There you go. Sure is a lot of wonder glue everywhere. <clears throat> what they were using to keep all the machines together. Looks like that worked. <laughs> Great success. Right. It's all these tiny little rooms. With tons of scrap metal. Get my find Harlan's friend who's been imprisoned by the Nightkin. So he's got to be somewhere down there in the prison, the, the jails. Did you search every inch of it? I mean, I'm trying to, yeah. Yeah, sorry. Delay, I forgot. I just used the jail key to get down here, so... Should I be looking for a dead body or something? Shouldn't be dead. Oh, here's think. a door. Maybe. Yep, I found Maybe. another door. Okay. Jesus. So I use this. The Ripper. I can't remember if it's New Vegas that yeah. has it, or one of the other games. They have an actual ripper called Jack. Nice. Yeah, they killed the shit out of her. Of course they did. Because Nightkin are assholes. wasn't a jailer unless it was this guy. Yep, it was him. Oh, there you go. Now I gotta figure out where... What's his face is. Back up top. Is he? I thought he was down here. Some of the ghoul. Hmm. The other one, not the glowing one. Oh, okay. Oh.
Yeah, he's gotta be down here somewhere. I just don't recall where. This seems familiar. Yeah. Did you find my friend? Yes, unfortunately. I see. Well, spare me the details. Damn it. I'm gonna miss that crooked yellow smile. All right. You did your part, so I'll do mine. Look around up here if you want. I'm gonna make a break for topside. Hmm. All right. Now there's a fucking shotgun in here. Stealth boy, that's what I was looking for on all of these jerks. You're supposed to be addicted to them, so give, yeah. give them to me. <laughs> They've been coming, becoming more scarce. Jesus Christ! Fucking goddamn mines or whatever. Yeah, it's these fucking shotguns. Ugh. I need to fucking make another doctor's bag. My last one. Good lord. There's Buy some more. shotgun fucking Where purple. God damn it! And then that stupid shit blew up too. Now my right arm's broken again. You can use a... Um... Stim packs on that specific body part. And I. Yeah, if you, um. Like, go to your stat menu, whatever, and it shows, uh. Your crippled parts and all that, you should be able to use, like, the stim packs on specific spots to try and heal them. If I remember correctly. Yeah. What the fuck is that? Brad Roach. I don't know, I think I did everything here. Definitely already searched... ...all these corpses. I looked upstairs, I didn't hardly see anything. Not fucking with any more of these terminals. Uh, the way to check to see if a terminal is um, rigged, you go around to the back of it. Good to know. 
No, you'll see the explosive or whatever attached to the back side of it. the fuck? How do I heal Boone? Or do I have to? Maybe I don't need to. I don't know. I thought I just saw his health for a second there. He's like grunting a lot. He should heal over time, I believe. searching up here but I'm not really finding anything like worth my time I'm spending here. Got quite the jump on us, don't we? For sure. Yeah, no, that was it. I don't get that. I do this quest for that. I guess whatever he gave me was it. When I beat the quest. Sorry, I had to disappear there for a second. The cat being an asshole. That's okay. I'm down here. This isn't the right way, no. Alright. Sure is grunting a lot. <laughs> Stop messing around with the intercom, smooth skin. Get moving. Get moving. Everybody's gone now. Oh no, that they remember they moved to us. I was about to say. Yes. There's nobody's downstairs. Maybe I can take all their stuff when they inevitably all kill themselves. Is the way clear? I don't know if that's an option. Your last name is Bright? That's funny. An auspicious name, don't you think? It was mine before I became as I am now. Before the Great War, even. 
Truly does the Creator author a destiny for each and every one of us. And the demons are gone. Praise the Creator, and bless you, Wanderer. The way is clear. I will lead my flock through the basement to the sacred site. I hope you will come find us there, Wanderer. There is much to be done. Takes off running. They have to get there before me. Otherwise, the story doesn't make sense. This one didn't run. Hello. I wish she would. I was going to take some stuff. Oh, she's gone now. All your stuff is mine now. <laughs> Belongs to me. Boone's making some really weird noises. It makes me want to heal him. Well, then heal him. Slept for one hour because fuck them. <laughs> I'm losing karma even though they all ran off. They don't care, man. Oh, I want that. So I'm just going to be a bad guy. I mean, kill them. Just for stealing shit. That's fair. I suppose. Kind of shitty how stealing, whether or not you're caught, affects your karma. Yeah, I'm gonna have to agree with you there. I don't remember which way I came in. There was more stuff to take elsewhere. I don't think there was, to be honest. Just a bunch of BS. Like empty, always. Empty filing cabinets. It made this place look creepy as hell. On purpose. Well, why not? <laughs> it's supposed to be somebody's, like... Living space. A bunch of somebody's. Oh shit. Um, uh, I don't take fall damage. Um you should. Mm. Well, I hope I didn't want to search this body. It's just a bunch of mutilated 
art. <laughs> I'm gonna grab me a drink real quick. Okie dokie. Damn. What? I was just trying to up my science. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a science I check. With you one last time before I descend into the or a repair check, which I don't have anything to put on for that anyway. That we will remember for all eternity how you delivered us to the threshold of the great journey. Our preparations are nearly complete, but the rockets that will carry us to salvation are yet missing vital components. If you would still help us, Wanderer, speak to Chris. Yeah, I'm not a he can tell you what all the finite details. There is no way that we can thank you enough, like Wanderer. Your needed. arrival here was a blessing. We will remember you always. Are you seriously going to make your great journey on these rockets? Yes. The rockets will convey us to our promised land in the far beyond. Vision upon vision has confirmed it. Those rockets will convey you and your flock straight into the ground. I understand your concerns, friend, and I thank you for voicing them. But the Creator's will for us has been made manifest. 
Let's talk about Chris. After all that you have done for us, I suppose you deserve to know everything. When Chris came to us, we tried to convince him that he was human. But this only angered him. He seemed... lost. We decided to let him stay with us for a few days, over the course of which we learned that his technical skills far surpassed our own. It became clear that the Creator had sent him to us, to ensure the success of the Great Journey. Equally clear was that Chris should labor in blessed ignorance of his humanity, and his inability to make the journey himself. It is no coincidence that two humans have been vital to the success of the Great Journey. It is my belief that the Creator sent you, and Chris, to expiate the sins of your kind against mine. Your Redeemer's both. Hmm. So you're gonna leave Chris behind? Such is the Creator's will. Vision upon vision has shown me that, were Chris to accompany us, he would die in minutes. The radiation around the launch pad alone would kill Chris in minutes. The radioactivity of the far beyond is much stronger. Okay. None of my business. Make a joke of it, of it, or you've been using him. You've been using, yeah, but Chris is an asshole. What do I fucking care? Well, it's none of my business. Yeah. Now, well, it's less interesting. It is the Creator's will, and I must submit. There is no malice in it. We would take him with us if we could. <laughs> Goodbye, Jason. There is no way that we can thank you enough, Wanderer. Your arrival here was a blessing. We will remember you always. Always. This is the Creator's will. Is it? Yes. Yes. Have <laughs> they just disappeared down a manhole? I guess. Jason says that I am to cooperate with you on the final tasks necessary to launch the Great Journey. What do you do here? I'm the Flock's resident engineer. I've always been good with machines. Jason says the Great Journey would have been impossible without me. Of course, my skills aren't much use unless I have the right materials. That's where you come in. Why don't they let you work down on the launch pad? When I joined the Flock, Jason made it clear that he wanted me to supervise the repairs, not do them myself. It would be a waste of my gifts to work on just one system at a time. From up here, I've been able to supervise the entire project. He can blow him up if we piss him off enough about it, I bet. Uh, so the Great Journey will use those rockets? Obviously. It's taken months, but I've nearly got them in working order. Soon they'll take us to the far beyond. I was skeptical at first, of course, being a man of science. But Jason is certain, and I believe in Jason. My radiation down there would kill you, Chris, because you're human. I thought we were past all that, smooth skin. But you just can't resist the chance to mess with me. Typical human. Don't be an idiot, Chris. I was human once, you know. Grew up in Vault 34, northeast of here. Nice upbringing if you like assault rifles and target practice. But oh, you prefer machines that don't shoot people? Not so nice then. Who should maintain the Vault's reactor? Hauser? Mitchell? No. Make it Haverson. He likes machines. Haversome won't mind getting irradiated. Haversome won't mind mutating. He's already ugly as it is. Haversome won't mind when his hair starts falling out after a few years. 
There's no connection, Haversum. You're neurotic. Ugh. You left your vault because you were going bald? Bald? You call this bald, smooth skin? I'm a monster. A monster! <laughs> Sounds like a shitty reason. Uh, I want the speech check, but I don't think I have anything for speech. Later. Alcohol? Oh, yeah? Yeah. It didn't, uh, I believe it helps your, uh, I think it's charisma. I need to talk to fucking this. No, it's a. What did I say it was? It should be an aid. Um. No, what did I say? I needed a pass. Speech? Yes. Fine by me. I'll be drunk as shit. I need five more speech. Well, um. It boosts charisma in of itself. It's not directly to speech. It boosts a bunch of skill. Uh, the the it boosts the skills that are directly correlated to charisma. Okay, I still need five of remember. them. You actually need to mix it up between because if you just do five of the same one, it won't stack. But if you mix it, they typically stack. So if you do a whiskey, a vodka, and a beer, it might stack. And you can always double check your skill stats after you drink it in your menu before you try to talk to them again. I can what now? You can, after you drink your stats and your pip boy and see how much your increase is. I don't know where speech is. It'd be under skills you see your perception charisma I think I have enough yep. are down. you ready to get started Those charisma is boosted to A so get on to skills nope I need 50 Speech. oh you need 50 bye yeah balls Sir, go to your aid. There we go. Are you ready to get started? Mentex <laughs> rockets aren't going to launch like a themselves. Or a, a small person. Jason told me himself the great journey is for ghouls only. You're not going. Oh god. You're telling me the truth, aren't you? Oh no, how could they do this to me? For two years, my god, I've been a joke to them. Do you have any idea how easy it'd be for me to sabotage those rockets? That'd be a joke, huh? One hell of a joke. That'd be murder, Chris, and you're no murderer. What, you think I'm too stupid to pull it off? I know enough to get their rockets working, don't I? So I can make them fail, too. <clears throat> it's not a matter of smarts. You'd never forgive yourself. Like I could forgive myself for getting duped like this? They used me, and now they'll throw me away. They'd take you if they could, Chris, but you'd die. And dying would be worse than this? Used up and thrown away like garbage? 
They're gonna revere you as a saint, Chris. Oh, so I've redeemed the human race, is that it? What a crock. The human race can't stand me. That's not oh, true, Chris. Man. You're all Sabotage right. Sabotage is a great so, idea. you want me to accompany you on your adventures Oh, across Jesus the Christ. Is that He's it? a companion. There's a little he town is? called Novak down the road. I guess he's going to go to Novak. Life among humans again? That's what you're suggesting? I guess. I guess it's the only chance I've got. I can't believe I'm agreeing to this, but I'll give it a try. I'll get Jason and his flock on their way, and then I'll head for Novak. Yeah. So is that it, or...? Probably talk to the other guy again. I don't know. He's down there. I don't know how to get down there. Now. I believe you can launch the ships if you want. Evening. From what? I can't interact with any of this shit. What is the cursor point oh. to? To Chris? Are you ready to get started? Yeah. Oh, I gotta go get the stuff. Going to launch themselves. Yep. How can I help? I was close to completing work on the rockets before we were driven into hiding on the top floor. Two components were missing quantity of isotope 239 igniting agent and a set of thrust control modules the igniting agent is highly radioactive and decays quickly that's why we can't use the drums that leak down on the launch pad it's no longer potent enough i need you to find an intact shielded container of the igniting agent as for the thrust control modules they were custom built for these rockets they won't even launch without them Okay. I don't think I have any questions. Right. Go on. Nope, I don't. Alright, I'll get the igniting agent. Very well. We don't need a huge amount. Two to three liters should be enough. Bye. Bye. I have no idea why they wouldn't like you, Chris. <laughs> Seem like a super fun guy. Because they're a-holes. Not mad at the world constantly or anything. These barrels are gonna work. It's with all the Abraxo cleaner everywhere. I, I'm trying to remember. It might be used to create something, but I don't remember. Fucking told me to go this way, and now it's saying don't go this way. Ah, oh, boy. So ridiculous. Yeah, they tell me to go this way. Yeah, so I just gotta follow it.
Smacked me right in the face. Fucking door. What are the empty syringes for? All these ghouls have like three bottle caps on them. me to go outside, I guess. Well, my alcohol wore off. I think my fucking quest changed. No? Didn't. Oh, I have to go somewhere, like, pretty actually far away. To get that. Back to Novak? Why? Can I fast travel? Yeah. Let's do that. And then I think I'll be calling it for the evening. I did go a little over because I know I started late. And, uh... Yeah, that happened. Yeah. Started okay. late, and then the internet started being a butthead, and all that fun stuff. But, uh, yeah. Thanks to everybody that came to hang out, and thank you for chatting with me, Fen. For sure. It was a blast. <laughs> it's always Bye. fun chatting, even though I, I was trying to play Fallout myself, but it wasn't going to work. It didn't have all my DLC on this Xbox, so I, I couldn't even play it. It would have started, and I would have had none of my shit. Uh, tomorrow is Friday night, so we'll be playing more Dead Space. So I look forward to that. Uh, all right. Yeah. So I look forward to seeing you guys on the next one.